How is the ride? How is the subscriber meetup? The subscriber, I feel it was a success. We uh, we deliver what we supposed to, and I aim was to share all our all our experiences. Make sure that motor vlogging for a cause, motor vlog for a cause, uh, comes across to a lot of people. That was we were successful in doing that. We shared part four with a few privileged people. Uh, so yeah, it was a success. Ah. Good morning, YouTube. I'm Ogie F. This is Rage. And we are heading to PKC and then heading over to Lunavla for my subscriber meetup. So we're supposed to meet quite a few riders over here. No one's here? Joe, you wait here, I'll go with the petrol pump, he has to fuel up. Okay, so we've now got eight bikes with us, a uh, couple of RCs, SP3 on the CBR today, 250, uh, twins back on the Himalayan. Okay, let's move. Oh, dude, can you come down? This is not a proper angle, dude. Yeah. <laughs> See, I want, I want to say he's doing this for a very long time. It's like three years and maintaining that discipline for so long is epic and I seriously respect him a lot for what he's doing. He's an amazing human being. We're now heading to the Vashi Toll and uh, at the Vashi Toll we're expecting to meet quite a few other members of our riding group as well. subscriber meetup uh, I've attended and it has been really great. The turnout is quite huge and Ogi, uh, special credits to Ogi and Ralph for this, for bringing all the motor vloggers under one hood and the experience so far has been brilliant. The second group's behind, the second group's on their way. Ours is here, no? Chal, let's move, let's move. Likewise, likewise. Hey, good morning. What's your name? Ashish. Ashish, nice to meet you. Yash, Murjar, Siddharth, okay. Where are you guys from? Pune, Mumbai? Okay, nice. So close by then for you all. Yeah, okay. Hi, good morning. You are? Moto Wolf. Moto Wolf. I think you commented or something somewhere. Yeah, yeah I remember her name. Alrin, nice to meet you. Rajat. Okay, nice to meet you, man. Pune, Mumbai? Mumbai. Mumbai, okay, nice.
Let's get this started now. So, how many people are from Mumbai over here? Just raise your hand and make some noise also if you can. That's the kind of noise I want. Okay. How many of you are from Pune? Just raise your hands. So, firstly, I want to start by apologizing and thanking you guys for something. So, firstly, my apologies. I know riding season has just started for us. Uh, it's been raining for extra long, I think, this year, and we've been waiting to get our bikes out. But I think uh, I want to apologize firstly for having the meetup so early in the, in the at the start of the riding season. I know some of you were waiting to get your bikes out and go to a real, a proper riding destination instead of just coming here for a meetup or something. So my apologies for that. But I also want to thank you guys for making it to the event in spite of such so short notice. I think I gave you all a week, weeks worth of notice, if not slightly more than that. Yeah. But I think you know the, the fact that you guys have come out today and spent one of your riding days with uh, with me means a lot. Um, apart from me, there's quite a few other motor vloggers as well around here. Can all the motor vloggers around you just raise your hands, please? <laughs> Come on, raise your hand, yeah, that's okay. <laughs> We've got somewhat of an event planned out for you, so there's speakers in the projector for a reason. Uh, before we get into that, though, how many of you have? How many of you know that I have a second channel? Just raise your hand. Okay, there's some of you who, who didn't, I, and, and I noticed that while speaking with you all in the parking lot. Uh, there's a second channel called Moto Vlog for a Cause, which uh, Ralph and I are part of. Ralph, just stand or do some oh. some dance move. Oh. He dances well also, but he's better than me. If you've not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. Tell your friends about it because uh, it's for a good cause, obviously, and it's not going to stop. We have this one cause for the Cancer Foundation. Going ahead, we might uh, move on and branch out to certain other things. Part three has been released. That's the last video we released on the second channel. Uh, how many of you have seen part 4? Someone, someone raised their hand back there. Okay, but why? You don't qualify. Okay, so... <laughs> so, what we're going to show you all is a, is a preview of part 4. I was sitting up last night editing as much as I could, but... Uh, no, no, not just yet. So, while I'm saying it's a preview, it's about an 11-minute video, and it will really get into details about why we decided to, to meet him. And you'll see snippets of our conversation with him as well during the, the entire meetup. I want to personally thank each and every one of you for coming today again to, to the meetup. Um, I never expected this kind of, of turnout. I saw, I saw the Biking Brotherhood come together in, in the event which I set up on Facebook and that meant a lot to me. I saw people posting things like, hey, I'm coming from so and so place. Is there anyone else riding from here? And the very next second or the very next minute, there was a response from someone saying, hey, buddy, I'm coming from here as well. Why don't we meet up and ride? You know, and give yourselves a round of applause for that, guys. There's this generic term which people call, oh, so you ride a bike, so you're a biker. And how many of you think that's true, if you ride a bike or a biker? That's not 100% true, right? There's a lot more that goes into that. Uh, we're not jerks, we don't cut off people in traffic. We're not jerks, we don't... I, mean, I, I flip people off, but that's a different, <laughs> that's a different thing altogether. We, don't, we, follow, we obey the rules, we know how, what, what safety is. And we know the risks involved as well. We've seen people get affected because of not uh, wearing the right kind of gear. Uh, I think it's, it's important that we promote safety in whatever area we can. I had these kids come up to me yesterday uh, on their cycles. And they were saying they watch my channel as well. And that's when I, I really started to realize how much of an influence we as a motor vlogging community and we as a biking community can have on future generations of, of bikers or people who at least use the road in, in some way or form. There's a small story I want to share with you. Do you like stories? No, not ghost stories. <laughs> it's too bright to say ghost stories. No? The effect is gone. Ad is in the back there. Um, so, you all know I work along with, with doing YouTube, right? It's, it's not solely YouTube. And because of that, I've, I've, been, I've been privileged to work with managers who have a lot of knowledge around life itself and not just work. And uh, there was this one uh, mantra which one of my managers shared with me. He said, um, when you're starting off, associate your, yourself with the right people. Collaborate with the right people. Get to know a little more from them. When you start to progress, you're not always perfect. Start to consult them and get better with, with whatever knowledge they have. Right? But don't steal from them. Learn from them, learn with them. And finally, when you make it somewhere in life, when you start to make progress, that's when you start to take those people along with you. So you never leave them alone, because they helped you when you needed them. And with that being said, there's a few people in the crowd today who I want to call up to this area over here and uh, kind of give them my gratitude for, for helping me along the way. And 
just to get them out there as well. So in no particular order or anything. So you all have met Ralph. So Ralph, why don't you come up here and just stand and make it embarrassing for yourself. Come up. <laughs> Chasing Nirvana. Chasing Nirvana rides a bullet. He doesn't really show his face a lot, but come and show your face over here now. <laughs> Roadrunner 94, if I'm not mistaken. Roadrunner, he changed it to 50, okay. 250. Upgraded. He upgraded, yeah. Biker 390. The baby face assassin. <laughs> Buff Moto, the slim guy at the back, come. <laughs> SP3 rides. <laughs> Arid. Arid, come. Okay, there's Life Stealer as well, come. Akash, I think yeah, I, I think most of you would recognize Akash now when he comes to stage. How many of you all know who he is? Okay, if you all see him on a bike, you'll know who he is, I think. Once he starts driving his knee around the place, yeah. Uh, we also have uh, Gaurav, Prabhu, Gaurav. No, you come up. Come, come ahead. Uh, we have uh, Salim, MSK Vlogs as well. Come up. Creative, I don't, can I abuse in the mall? Creative bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Claw, where is he? <laughs> Captain Claw, come up. This guy hides a lot, huh? so we have to really search for him. Okay, Wanderstein, why are you hiding? Come, Wanderstein as well. Scooter life. life, yes. He's somewhere at the back, I saw him there. Ah, there he is, okay. Scooter Life. Okay, and yeah, so, so these distinguished gentlemen are, are people who I, I get to interact with on a daily basis. Uh, people who I probably would get advice from if, if it's something as simple as a mic setup, something as simple as editing effects or whatever. These guys are, are my go-to people. And apart from that, there are, they, they leave you 400 messages on a WhatsApp group if, if you're bored. Please make sure that you at least check out their content. If you like what they do, subscribe. If you don't, abuse them in the comment section. <laughs> Give them a round of applause. Yeah. So next up what we have is uh, a preview of part 4 uh, of our ride to Nagpur. This, this, is only a, this is only a preview of it, so it's, it's 11 minutes, but we'll show you what's going to come in, in part 4. So, to answer your question, in a nutshell, one hour every day after work is what I dedicate. And then my weekends, I'm a very boring person because I sit down in front of my computer and I'm editing. So, yeah. Yes, I am. Stop it. I am. <laughs> I am a boring person my weekends. Stop it. Okay. But thank you for that question. Yeah. So, on a final note, thank you again for, for spending your Sunday riding over to this, to this location and uh, interacting with me and the other YouTubers and, and motor bloggers around here. Um, enjoy your time. We've got water somewhere on the side over there, Ralph. We've got water over there. It's, if it's getting hot right now, you guys can go and drink a nice refreshing cup of water. If you'll need pictures, I'll click pictures with you guys. And when you'll meet me now, I'll, I'll be giving you all stickers as well. Okay? Thank you again and enjoy the rest of your video. Come. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, one second. This is probably one of my first few subscribers ever. Thanks. Right? He's been with the channel since the start and he messaged me quite often as well. And thank you so much for coming. It's the first time I'm seeing you, yeah, I think, yeah. without your helmet. I think I saw you once again yeah, yeah. with your helmet. Oggy is one of the Mumbai, actually Indian motor blogger OG, is the original gangster. He's been doing it for a long time and I have nothing but utmost respect for him and 
seriously, there is nothing we, we can suggest. Any first can suggest to him because he has tried and tested everything. He knows what he's doing, and he's really good at it. Only thing people are always complaining is the regularity. He's working as well, so he's working on it, and I'm sure he'll keep on giving us great content as always. So, Ansel, what do you think about the subscriber meetup? The meetup's really good. If you meet Augie anytime, he's the most humble YouTuber I have ever met. I've met many other YouTubers. He's the most humble YouTuber I've ever met. When you meet him for the first time, you'll feel like you've met him like from a long, very time. I don't know. I can't explain, express my feelings. He's a really, really good guy. Subscribe to him. Going awesome, man. Augie, for the win. And then share that evidence with us. So we know that you're capable of doing something you've been consistent with. And you're someone who can use a lot of people. So we're waiting for you.